The DIY 8 is a step sequencer kit designed to be built at home. The kit comes complete with panel, PCB and through hole components ready to solder following the instructions. I will set up a basic patch showing how the sequencer can be used, then I will go through some of the modes. Take the CV output of the sequencer and put it into an oscillator. Next take the gate output and put that into your envelope. Patch the envelope into a VCA. Now working my way backwards, patching in the filter. A mixer. And a few different outputs from my oscillator. And to begin a sequence, I'll hit some gate buttons on the sequencer. You can play and pause the sequence either by pressing the play button or by feeding a gate signal into the play input. Gate height to pause, and gate height to start. Patching into the reset input, a gate high signal resets the sequence. The DIY 8 has six modes designed to help you sculpt funky bass lines and leads on the fly. The sequencer starts in mode 1. The switches turn on and off the gate signals. In mode 2, each switch turns on or off the slide for that step. The glide control changes the length of the glide. Mode 3 skips the selected step. Mode 4 has four repeat positions for each switch, as demonstrated. Mode 5 uses the first five switches. The first is forward, second is reverse.
that is ping pong. Fourth is random. And the fifth changes the output range between 5 and 10 volts. Mode 6 acts as a quantizer, taking you through different scales. Switch 1 is no scale. 2 is chromatic. 3 is major. 4 is minor. 5 is pentatonic major. Six is pentatonic minor. Seven is major chords. And eight is fifths. There we have it. A funky sequencing tool with some useful modes.